believing in the Western terminology, you say, yes, I believe. Me? Uh, yes, I know it's right. Not in Islamic terminology. If you declare your Iman, that means if you put into practice, then you will be understood that you have Iman in it. You have Iman in it. Believe is no word for us to. We discard this word. If you have Iman, what Allah is saying here, then it will change your destiny. It will change the destiny of the community of the Muslims all over the world. Of having Iman in this article of Iman, that He is with you where you are, and you say, Labbaik, Ya Allah, I believe, I Iman, my Iman is that you are right now here. I have Iman. What do you mean by Iman? I don't want you to say, I believe. Iman means whatever is there, I act upon that. When you act upon that, they become moment or momina. Never ever, you who are there, whom the message reach, never ever show any authority complex or weakness, you know, or humiliate yourself or humble yourself before the enemies of Allah, the polytheist, you know, all those who deny and reject him. You are much superior to them because you are Khalifa to Allah. Claim it. Have Iman in this and you, Allah will always be with you. If you will not have Iman with, in this, then either a shaitan or nafs will be with you. Have a choice. Either your reign, your control will be in the hands of Allah or shaitan or your nafs. They are your own desires. Well, three things, you have three options. The first and the only option open for you is that you have Iman and act upon this Iman. Mold your conduct, mold your manners, mold your life, mold your ideology in this, that your Allah is with you and He is watching you what you are doing. Become aware of the Allah's uh, presence, not only that he's watching you what you're doing, he's watching right now. You understand? Yes. Until this Iman is not rasikh, goes deep down into your soul and emanates through it, your deeds are, you know, all, you know, controlled or, or deed performed in the light of this Iman, that your Allah is with you, your creator, your helper, your protector, your razak, you know, your friend, your companion, the one who loves you is with you.
Exactly what tawakkul means. It means that I don't see the solution. I don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. But I do know one thing for sure, and that is Inna Maya Rabbi Sayahdi. Indeed, my Lord is with me, and He will guide me through. And when we have that kind of attitude, Allah promises us something: that He will split seas for us. That situations that look impossible, Allah will make a way out. That situations where we don't see a solution, Allah will give us a solution from places we never imagined. Whoever puts Allah first, taqwa, whoever has God consciousness, whoever focuses on Allah first, whoever guards themselves from the wrath of Allah, who makes Allah first, Allah will make a way out for them. And He will provide for them from places they never imagined. Strange from their families, although estranged from their houses and their clans and tribes, although estranged from their city, they were in a very familiar place with Allah Jalla Jalal wa Ta'ala Ta'ala Matu. People what the Prophet ﷺ told us in Tainmari Ta Ta'ala Raf, in Allah he fir Rakha ya'arif kafi shidda, and get to know Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in Rakha in times of ease, and we live relatively in times of ease, no matter how quote unquote it perceived to be, we do not live. In times of difficulty, as it once was upon quote unquote the human family, the Arif Kafi Shidda. But difficult times will come. The tongue of truth has promised that difficult times will come, the Arif Kafi Shidda. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will know you in those difficult times. We were created to know God, to know Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And there are those people who will fulfill the covenant with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala by ensuring their entire kiana, their entire being is dedicated to the knowledge of the divine Jalla Jalalu wa ta'at azamatu doesn't matter whether they're in good times they endeavor to know Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala it doesn't matter even in difficult times difficult times hatta they endeavor to know Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala daytime they endeavor to know him subhanahu wa ta'ala nighttime they endeavor to know him Jalla Jalalu wa ta'at azamatu وَاصْبِرْ نَفْسَكَ مَعَ الَّذِينَ يَدْعُونَ رَبَّهُمْ بِالْغَدَاتِ وَالْعَشِيِّ يُرِيدُونَ وَجْهَ Be patient amongst the people. يَدْعُونَ رَبَّهُمْ Who call upon their Lord, they pray to their Lord. بِالْغَدَاتِ وَالْعَشِيِّ By morning and by evening. يُرِيدُونَ وَجْهَ Desiring وَجْهَهُ The countenance of God. جَلَّ جَلَالَ وَتَعَتْ عَذَمَةُ Behold 